You know when uh, you wake up in the morning, guys, and you got that erection, and it's hard to poo? Because, like, either you lay your erection on top of the toilet seat, but then you poo a little bit, and you pee, and the pee gets on the floor, or you push your erection down under the toilet seat so it doesn't, like, hit the top of the toilet seat, because that's gross. You gonna flip off of it? I don't know. Nigga, we trying to psych stuff up for, like, 20 minutes. Come on, bro. Do something. I need some good footage. Oh, it's gonna shuffle. Just die. Do something and die so I can get some good vlog footage. Tim, that's really messed up to joke about death. So, oh my god, I can't believe you'd say that, Tim. I thought you were better than that. I'm unsubscribing right now. Rick's better than you. Rick's way better and funnier and a better rapper. And skinnier. And skinnier and more Asian. <laughs> Anyways, can't believe you said that. <laughs> Rick would never say that. <laughs> oh, here we go, here we go, here we go! Some action, baby! Ball squats. <clears throat> yeah! Alright, let's go. I'm at Bubba Gumps in Long Beach, catching up with a longtime friend of mine, William Askew. What's up, man? What's up? Known this dude since third grade. Third grade. Third grade. We're talking about back in the day, we used to go to this club called Boogie. As soon as we turned 18, it was in Anaheim. Um, and uh, there was a two pop. And it was two pop. There was a black people room. Uh, black people it room was the reggae room. The reggae room. But, uh, the black people. Yeah, the black people. It was room. the black people. <laughs> but around 11 o'clock, it would start smelling like weed. And then um, someone would always get like stabbed, so they have to shut it down early. That shit was cracking though. It was popping. <laughs> that was the spot. Boogie. <laughs> so I'm just I'm chilling. I'm listening to this uh, Lauren Hill Miseducation of Lauren Hill, a classic album. If you kids haven't heard it, then you should download it. Um, and I just realized, you know, you know you're getting old. Not that I'm old, but you know you're getting old when. Uh, you haven't seen the homie in a long time and instead of being like, yo son, what's cracking tonight? Let's hit the club, let's hit the bar, what's cracking? It's like, yo, let's grab some nice conversation over dinner, man. When that's the agenda, you know, when all you really want to do is, is catch up with somebody. I'm getting so old. <laughs> so I'm about to grab some uh, dinner with my beautiful homegirl, uh, Andrea's Choice. We're going to get some sushi. I haven't seen her in a long time. Um, she's a dear, dear friend of mine. And uh, hey, can y'all? Is this is this shirt is this shirt gay? Like I bought it a long time ago, and I found it in my closet, and then I never wore it. And I was like, hmm. Now is this uh, swag? Is this stylish or is this gay? I'm wearing it either way. Honestly, I I don't even really care what you say because I, I like the way it looks and it's comfy. So uh, yeah, I probably changed my beanie though. This beanie's a little too urban for this type of shirt. You feel me? I don't know if you feel me, but. I don't know if you even care. Yeah, I don't care. Alright, let's save that for Tim's Bakery. <laughs> so I've been waiting down here for choice for like 15 minutes. Shake my head. I mean, what do you expect when you're kicking it with a makeup guru? Ugh. So I finally, uh, she finally came downstairs. Uh, worth the wait though, looking bad, as usual. Bad, not bad meaning bad, but bad meaning good. Angie's choice, as always. Let me get the fit, uh, just, you know, for all my male oh, viewers. I've got, oh, it's Huh? I'm dressed for the fall. You're dressed for the fall, yeah, yeah. And let me see the nails for the female viewers. What? Let me show them what took you so long. I did horror nails. Horror nails. Don't lie. You just you put too much black stuff on there. You couldn't get it off on time, so it started dripping. And then. <laughs> <laughs> so I ordered some edamame for me and Choice to eat, and I noticed there's like a, she threw some empty shells, empty like uh, uh, pods. I don't know what you call them. Back in the friggin' one that had the food in it. So I was like, you know what? Fuck that shit. I threw all the all the empty ones in the full one. What now, Choice? I'm tweeting about it. <laughs> okay. No, no, you're good. So Choice is uh, showing me her uh, her snake right now. What's it's your, my baby. That's your baby. What's your snake's name? Reptile. Reptile, that's his name? Yeah. And uh, I'm about to show her my snake right now. You scared my snake. Show me your snake. <laughs> <laughs> Crazy. You're, you're too hardcore. He says, I love you. Oh, I love you too. <laughs> so I'm over here at California Pizza Kitchen, eating some lettuce wraps, because, you know, I'm trying to get sexy and shit, uh, with Anthony of Mix TV. Um, how many TVs is, how many, how many homes is Mix in? Uh, we're in 5 million right now. Okay. Call their local cable provider and ask for Mix. Ask for them okay. to carry Mix. Mix, MYX TV. And you're going to want to carry Mix because I'm 
gonna start a TV show with them. It's a little sketch comedy slash, like basically a, a, my, my version of Chappelle's show. It's gonna be dope. Uh, it's gonna be dope. In LA. Man, you're gonna be home, man. <laughs> Later. <laughs> Bye. I'm not gonna. Excuse say me. Excuse me. Excuse me. May I? You. <laughs> Can I have sex with you? Excuse me. Can we have sex, please? Not her. No. No, all of you. <laughs> so uh, I'm in uh, Hollywood right now, driving to uh, to record a dumbfounded's rehearsals for a show he has tonight. Uh, I know I'm good, bro. Not you. Him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um. So we're in LA. You know what I'm saying? West Side, listen to some West Side Connection, like some real thugs. I'm swerving a little bit because I'm vlogging. Oh, I didn't see that. Yeah, yeah. And we gotta do a track together, man. What's going on, man? Slacking, bro. We are slacking on <laughs> What you doing Thursday morning next week? I'ma come through. Uh, blah, blah. So, no pickup. So, That's it. Okay. So, uh, I'm at I'm at Uncle Andre's barbecue in uh in uh Hollywood. Are we in Hollywood? Los Angeles? Los Angeles? Studio, Los Angeles. City. Studio City. Right, 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 right. With the lovely Alex Reed. Y'all might remember her from a past vlog. Hold on. You get the good light on you. Lighting is stupid. Oh my God, I look bad. <laughs> no, you don't look bad. Bad lighting. <laughs> no, you know you know how the, the straight down lighting is just lame. It's like scary. Anyway, no, you look lovely. Don't even show. <laughs> Alex Reed. <laughs> And Rick, of course. <laughs> How's that gumbo? Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How's that gumbo? Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, it's delicious. This gumbo is delicious. How's that gumbo? Leave me alone. <laughs> Mom! Yeah! Dad! Check it out, guys. This is the issue of Entertainment Weekly I was in. Isn't that cool? Isn't that cool? They likened me to a tribe called Quest. Huh? Pretty friggin' cool. And apparently I was on the episode of 2020 tonight. I didn't see it though about YouTube stars. It was like a tiny, they showed like a clip, like a quick little thing on one of my videos in the thing. So, little thing. My, they showed my little they thing. Show little, they showed little my, thing. my little thing on the thing, yeah. Mm. <laughs> now I'm gonna be in, uh, so now I'm going to pack for Seattle because uh, I leave at 7 o'clock in the morning. Um, everyone's going to be out there, you know, uh, Dumbfounded, Jay Rise, uh, Lil Christ, Andrew Garcia, Aaron Paula, Michelle Martinez, Just Kidding Films. Freaking everybody's going to be out there, man. It's going to be a good time. Seattle's dope. I love performing in Seattle. And uh, so, yeah, I'm going to pack. And uh, as you can see, my room's a mess. Oh, shout out to Freedoms.com for sending me more snapbacks. <laughs> And, um, yeah. Good night. The royal penis is clean, your highness. Thank you, king shit.